Air pollution has far-reaching consequences for health, climate change and development. For Sub-Saharan Africa, with its growing population, reliance on solid fuels for cooking and rapid urbanisation, this presents a particular challenge. Yet to date, there has been very limited capacity for high quality air pollution measurement in Africa. That's now set to change with the opening of a new facility at the Kenya Medical Research Institute in Nairobi. Managed by the Liverpool University's Clean Air Africa Consortium, this will transform the prospects for tackling air pollution in Africa. The most important measure of air quality is small particles, or PM2.5. The gold standard for PM2.5 measurement is called gravimetric. This involves weighing the amount of particles collected on a filter. As particle weights are very small, measurement needs a carefully controlled environment and highly accurate equipment. These requirements are provided by an air-conditioned laboratory and a Metler Toledo automated balance. Once checks have been made on ambient conditions, including laboratory temperature, the filter measurement cycle can be initiated. The first step is calibration. Standardized weights of 400, 200 and 100 milligrams are each measured three times. The filter to be used for collecting particles is weighed before deployment and then again afterwards, with the difference being the weight of PM2.5. Air pollution sampling is carried out using a device that sucks air through the filter at a constant flow rate, typically for 24 or 48 hours. This is the, uh, for measuring the particulate matter, right? Are you passing? Hi John. Hi Tim. So I got these samples for... Back at the laboratory, the exposed filter is weighed three times to ensure accuracy. Here we can see the results. On the left, the three pre-sampling weights and the average, and on the right, the three post-sampling weights and the average. The difference of 0.0599 milligrams is the weight of PM2.5 and this is divided by the volume of air that's been sampled to provide the PM2.5 concentration. This new laboratory is essential for high quality air pollution monitoring needed for Cleaner Africa's research. It also provides a unique and critical facility to support air pollution and health measurement across the continent.